Hey everybody, it's Kat. Welcome back for another video. This video is actually going to be kind of like a review for the Canon N2 slash a demo for me to look back at and decide which of these two cameras I want to keep. Uh, my husband bought me the Canon N2 for Christmas. It is a camera that I thought would be the ultimate vlogger cam. Um, I've wanted it since I first heard about it back like in the summer of 2014 and I was waiting for its release in December of 2014 and finally my husband got it for me and um, when I received it, you know, I was so excited and all of that and I even tried vlogging with it for a few days but I was not 100% content with it. Um, the quality of the video to me, as I replayed it back on the LCD, um, it was just grainy to me and I transferred it over to my computer and it still looked a little grainy but on YouTube it didn't look as bad. It kind of was comparable to the camera I used prior to the N2. And the camera I used prior to the N2 was the Canon S100. I absolutely love that camera. I've had it for three years, way before I started vlogging. And it has just been so good to me, but unfortunately it's just not working anymore. Or actually it is still working, but it's like on and off. It's pretty crazy right now. But anyway, I this is the second N2 actually that I have because the first one I returned and in hopes of getting another one and you know this one being better and hope, hoping that that first Canon N2 that I received was going to be like a dud and it was just a bad camera but um, it was pretty much the same quality um, but let me just tell you guys I am trying so hard to love this camera because if when I once I show it to you guys you guys will know why it's gorgeous um, but the second camera that I purchased last night is the Canon S120 and this is the latest version of the camera I was using prior to the N2 which was the S100 and this camera, the S120, is over a year old. They didn't come out with the S130 this year. There are rumors that the newest version of this is a G7X but I'm not sure if that is accurate. Um, but since I loved my S100, I figured why not try the S120, the latest version, hoping that I would love it. And so I did do some comparisons earlier all around the house, vlogging with both cameras, even outdoors, um, in the low lighting areas of the house, and the well-lit rooms as well. So yeah, first of all, I wanted to go over the Canon N2. Okay, so here is the N2. It is so compact, as you can see. It is perfect for vlogging. It is perfect for me to hold on to. I just um, easily have it around my wrist, the lanyard part. And look at this, you guys. It is so gorgeous. It's got the 180 degree flip screen. Do you guys see that? So do you guys see why this is perfect for vlogging? As a mother of three, with my three kids in tow, this is like perfect. I don't have to worry about a bulky camera. And it's just so easy for me to just hold on to while I'm vlogging. Um, it's, it's beautiful, you guys. It is gorgeous. It is everything I have imagined a vlogging camera to be, except for the video quality. And I will go more into that later. Um, so that is a Canon N2. So the other camera that I'm going to be choosing from is the Canon S120. And don't get me twisted, you guys. Um, let me just put it out there right now. I know that I cannot compare the S120 to the N2 because they are completely not in the same class of cameras. They are both power shots, but the S series are higher end um, than the N2. But I'm just doing the comparison between the two for my own sakes, just for me to choose between the two. Um, so all of you camera buffs and Canon buffs out there, don't attack me because I am not trying to compare the two saying that they're the same camera because I know for a fact they're definitely not. I know that the S100 and S120 or the S series are going to be higher end than the N series. But like I said, I'm just doing this comparison for me to decide from. This looks like my S100. Let me show you guys my S100. This right here is the S100. As you can see, this is the S120. They're about the same. They look the same. Uh, the design's just gotten a little better with S120. Um, but I absolutely love the S100, you guys. So with this camera, it unfortunately does not have the 180 degree flip screen. So I will still be vlogging 
like this as I normally do and I don't mind that it's just I feel like it's 2015 it's time for the flip screen you know um, but yeah, there's going to be so many things that I got to weigh out. My I got to figure out, you know, all the pros and cons between the two cameras. So we're going to have to see how these are going to look video-wise, side by side. And I'm going to try to put that up for you guys. And then I'm going to show you guys some of the specifications. I'm going to grab some of that info from the Canon website. So cuteness-wise, the N2 definitely wins. Um, it is just gorgeous and perfect for vlogging can't you guys see that and they're both lightweight it's not as heavy they're not bulky um which is going to make it hard for me to choose from as far as you know um like aesthetically or actually no you know what i'd have to say this is cuter aesthetically um but as far as like weight and um ergonomic wise i guess they're both similar but this would have to win just a tad but Overall, you guys, this is just cuter than this. Okay, you guys, so here is the PowerShot S120. Said this camera is over a year old. It came out, I believe, in 2013 with my cheat sheet on Canon.com. I'm gonna go over some of the specifications of the camera. This camera is only 12.1 megapixels. It says it's got a 5x zoom or 5x zoom. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm probably butchering all these terms. I don't know what these mean, but there's some of the stats on there. In the back, it's got a 3-inch LCD screen. It does not have the 180-degree flip screen, which should be ideal for vloggers nowadays, right? So what I love about the S120 or the S series is it's not bulky and I love the quality of my S100. So I figured this one would be a great camera to get if I decide not to get the N2. Just check it out. I like the fact that the lens retracts back into its body. And some people compare this camera to like a mini DSLR. The only downside to having these regular cameras for vlogging is you can't tell if it's going to be blurry or if you're in the shot. And you know it's 2015, it's time for flip screens. But anyway, this version of the S-Series does have a touch screen and I have it set to the highest quality and on auto because that's where I record at. And I'm not going to do my comparisons here, but I just wanted to show you guys how the camera looks. So this is how it would be when I am vlogging. And here is the beautiful PowerShot N2, the ultimate, would have been the ultimate vlogger camera. So let me tell you guys some of the specifications according to Canon.com. It is 16.1 megapixels and it's got the 8 times optical, 4 times digital zoom. This does have the 180 degree flip screen. Oop, I've had it upside down most this whole time. So there it is. Isn't it so gorgeous? Like I said, this is the second one that I received. The first one I returned because I was hoping the second one would be perfect. But here it is, and see how perfect it would be vlogging with it. It is so compact, and the design is so sleek. And I love that the lens does not stick out as well. It, it also retracts. You see that? So this camera would be perfect, but the LCD quality is not great. It is really grainy. And, you know, like I said, I don't know um, camera terms or anything to compare it with. And I am not comparing it with higher-end cameras as far as, you know, saying they're the same because they're not. I'm just comparing them again for myself. And I'm always saying that out there because I know I'm going to get attacked by all of you Canon gurus out there. Um, so I don't know, you guys. I don't know which to pick. This camera is $300 and this camera is $400. Um, they both have Wi-Fi. They're both touchscreen LCDs. But I think as far as the LCD playback and transferring it over to your computer, 
the videos are much more crisp with this one as opposed to this one. Some of the quality once uploaded to YouTube is not going to be perfect, so they both kind of look similar, but I don't know. I'm going to have to see when I play back the video side by side. So you guys, help me. What do you guys think? I thought I was going to keep this, but last night I went and purchased this because I wanted to compare the two. Since I was happy with my S100, I figured why not get the latest of that series? You guys see why I love the N2? It's just the picture quality as far as playing back. And I'm not going to be showing any photo comparisons with these cameras because that is not why I purchased them. I'm using this these cameras strictly for vlogging um, and I use my DSLR for photos. So. Yeah, there you have it, you guys. Isn't this one so pretty? This one's nice too, but it's just not as cute as this one. <laughs> okay, guys, help me pick. Or what do you guys think? What would you guys pick? In this shot, I am in my closet under the fluorescent light. To the left is the shot with the Canon N2, and to the right is a shot with the Canon S120. I look weird. And crazy just looking into the camera. <laughs> now I'm in a low lighted room. This is my vanity room. I only have three little candelabra light bulbs above me that are lit right now. I'm surprised to see that they're both pretty bright. These shots were taken in natural lighting because I'm standing right in front of a big window in my bedroom. Here I was filming in the loft upstairs. There's just a couple little windows there. It's pretty dark in here usually, but I was surprised to see that they're both pretty bright. But the S120 is more crisp while the N2 is a little more vibrant in color. Here I am filming outside and I admit I like them both when they're in broad daylight outside. There's just pros to both cameras when it's outside filming. Uh, the N2, the colors are much more vibrant, it looks brighter. The S120 is just absolutely crisp, um, but I am not complaining about the color either. I mean, my skin looks flawless in S120. And here I just wanted to film these because there's a lot of colors and I just wanted you guys to see how it looks in regular indoor lighting. Okay guys, so please help me decide. I mean, at the end of the day, it's ultimately going to be my choice. Um, but I would like to hear your feedback. Let me know if you guys see any difference between the side-by-side -side videos. Please let me know which camera you guys would pick if this were you trying to choose between the two. Um, because I am torn, you guys. Oh, I'm torn in between the two. Na 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 na. I don't even know the lyrics of that song. But anyway, so that's all for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Help me decide. Ah!